you know, one of my one of my dear friends was, uh, was Whitney Houston, right? She was my dear sister and friend. My friends, we have a good time. <laughs> but as you get older and you get wiser, you know, you stop a lot of the kid stuff. Big videos, and uh, it was I'm Every Woman. You know, it was kind of a rebel in me. Right? But the lyrics don't line up with the word of God. No way. I want to see the receipts. Because it started off with, I could cast a spell. I'm not singing that. <laughs> and it's like demonic. It's my deciding. It's my heart. It's what I want. You're listening to demonic stuff, and you wonder why you don't know what's going on. This is just uh, something that was preordained. But then she called me back for count on me. She's like, sis, I got the song. I was like, this is great because it lines up with my faith. I wasn't ignorant and I wasn't rebellious or defiant. So people come to my house and they ask me, do that dog bite? And I go, not me. <laughs> Regardless of you saying how it should be happening, you still got that teeth just standing up there with a lace front in their face every day. So what but at least I know what a man look like. Wait a minute, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, because this is why we send our kids out into the world, because you want to teach them the contradictions of the world. Now he conflicted because he's sitting at home getting a lesson of this ain't how it is. That's not how it's supposed to go. But guess what? This is the world that he's living in. No, he now he's to the because now he got older, he figured out he really didn't like dressing as a female. Now he got to do this shit for the rest of the We're life. We're not talking about that. Now he's, 